Hey, collective, let's see what messages come out. Somebody could be sitting back watching you. Like, this cat, he's face towards me, but his head just keeps spinning. He's like, not spinning, but going back and forth. He's watching all of the comings and goings, okay? So, that could be spirit watching over you, or somebody could literally be watching you, child. Oh. All right, what's going on for the collective? and thank you. Now these readings are for entertainment purposes only. Don't make anything big and don't put anyone above your own intuition. <laughs> it could be something here with your neighbors too, child. It could be all in your asshole. <laughs> Hear me. Alright, breaking trail. A breakthrough is at hand. It could be someone here with a fire or somebody looking for clues or something oh this could be a breakthrough within yourself y'all have to take it how it resonates okay so a breakthrough is at hand i feel like somebody could have been trying to get your attention somebody also could have been trying to stall stall something for you while something happens for them something is definitely moving in divine order okay Narrow pathway, tread thoughtfully. So this is giving the energy of like, watch how you speak, watch how you think, watch how you speak, that type of energy. That's what it's giving on that right there. What else, spirit? Uh, far away places, get ready for new horizons. But then you have this, um, cleansing waters some of you could go to uh, I always see it on Unsolved Mysteries they have these different bodies of water it's very healing okay with the purification activates vibrant life force some of you may go to a far away place go to a body of water that's, that has healing properties okay some of you may be going on a vacation. There could be, you could be having a lot of dragonflies around you. But it's because you are a, um, what's this? Some of y'all connected with Egypt. What's that, um, a lotus flower? You know, those scientists was trying to figure out why in all of those hieroglyphics they had the blue lotus flower. Like, what did it mean? Did it give them some type of power or... You know, they was trying to figure it out, okay? So, let's see what's going on right here for y'all today. Let's see what the right emotion is. Spirit, what's the message for the collective? What's the message? Let me something with Chinese letters or China or something. All right, so you have empathy. I'm open to seeing both sides of the situation and imagination. All right. Embrace and nourish the creative aspects of my mind. Okay, and service is at the bottom of the deck. For somebody here, it's like people feel like, how can I say it? You have to do this. Maybe there's something that you have uh, or something that you know how to do. And it's like they don't even feel like they need to ask for your permission. They just feel like, oh, you're supposed to do this. This is. Like, like, they feel entitled to you some type of way. And, and they feel like you should not even say nothing while this is going on. This is crazy, y'all. What is this? <coughs> and it really could have to do with some type of discovery, some type of breakthrough, right? But this uh, breakthrough is at hand. Hmm. So, with that being said, let's see what comes out. Yep. Some of you could be highly connected with Mother Earth. Now, here's the thing I don't like. I'm going to go ahead and point it out. I always tell y'all, this hand is a number on it, right? And it reminds me of the character 11 off of Stranger Things. So, with this Gaia card, maybe there's something that you can do or something like that, y'all. Where people feel like they're obligated to you. 
to you. To your energy or something, y'all. I don't know what the hell is here. And they feel like you should not say. They feel like you should not say that while this is going on. So I wonder what this is. Yeah. All right, you have next level money manager and independent. Hmm. If you are not self-employed, this is the time to have an entrepreneurial mindset. Your financial freedom will come from you being able to stand alone. You can do it. This card is a good indicator that your career or your finances will take a giant leap forward. Um, and you're about to take your finances to the next level or it's time to do so. There's some type of discovery or something, child, going on. Spirit says there's something better here. Okay. If this could be something with a gift or some type of natural talents or abilities. Waiting to be discovered. Right. So people could be with this. Okay, so I already said right here, you could be highly connected with Mother Earth, right? And so I always get, I already told you I get the character 11 off Stranger Things. And I get Carrie off of uh, the movie Carrie. You know, y'all know she had telekinesis and shit. Some of y'all could have some type of natural talents gifts or abilities but i don't know why people feel like they're supposed to they feel entitled to you i don't i don't understand okay now you have change and unstable so the this card already over here already says money manager and independent this is the time to have an entrepreneur mindset. Your financial freedom will come for you being able to stand alone because there could have been a lot of ups and downs with your finances. Because remember I said these people feel entitled. Maybe they felt entitled to your money. With this money manager, people could have felt entitled to your money. Whatever this change is that's coming is for the better. Embrace this change. Because we saw that card where it says there's something better. So you have a room full of people. But there's a skill you possess that needs to be shared with the world. And that's why these people feel entitled to your energy. Look at the first line. Well, there's a skill you possess that needs to be shared with the world. So maybe the people ain't asking you. They're just making you. It has something to do with your destiny. Believe in your dreams and your passions. Because with this, it says I, I embrace and nourish the creative aspects of my mind. Maybe this has to do, maybe somebody <laughs> is trying to study your mind or something. Believe in your dreams and your passions. It's your calling to follow them. Now, whatever led you to this point in your life, it was to direct you to a higher purpose. New exciting adventures await. Don't look back, only look to the future. And then you have planner here. So I just saw exploring. Somebody's exploring your mind. Somebody doing something, child. They feel and stories matter. Hmm. It's something that people feel entitled to. So for some of you, it's it's your actual money. Other people feel entitled to your money. For others of you, it's some type of ability that you have, some type of skill that you possess that needs to be shared with the world. I don't know what that is. But, um, yeah, that's what's going on for somebody right here. So let's pull a life purpose day and see what we get to come out. You could have been a case study for somebody. Spirit, what? What's going on? Tell me what's going on. What's going on? What is going on right here for the collective? 
Oh, I knew it was going to come out. I should have left it out. It was already out. Oracle cards. So some of you are able to discern answers and guidance for yourself and others through Oracle cards. I don't think that's it, but it could be. I don't know. I mean, that could be the reason, but that, that don't make sense because you know how many Oracle card readers it is on YouTube, child. These people feel entitled to you. All right? Yeah, and some of you guys have animal powers or maybe you can talk to him, communicate with him. What's this, what they call him? The dog whisperer? Maybe some of y'all can do that. Or you have this indestructibility. I don't know what that is about. But it's something that y'all got going on that other people feel. I just talked about, this says photokinesis. I just talked about that in my last reading. I said there's something with light. The ability to manipulate light. I said that y'all do have resurrection. Oh, no, I know ain't nobody doing that. <laughs> Ability to raise people from the dead. No, I ain't nobody doing that, child. Ooh, child, but there's some type of spiritual glow up or something. Someone's angels could have been caught on film. But that still doesn't say why these people think they're entitled to that. In the sunshine when she's gone On the darkness every day Ain't no sunshine when she's gone Alright, some of you may have broken some type of curse Every time she goes away I don't know I just talked about that breaking the curse in my last reading uh, I don't know if that was the collective or Sagittarius reading, because I'm the only two I do for real, for real on this channel. I do Sagittarius readings and I do collective readings. But um, with that Gaia, that strong connection with Mother Earth, and then this 144, chosen energy, some of y'all might can't communicate with animals, child. Or someone's angels could have been caught on film, or there was some type of spiritual glow. It's something that people feel like. They could put blocks on your YouTube channels. Telekinesis. I told you I said it reminded me of Carrie with the telekinesis. Ability to move objects. I did a reading one night where I said these people was looking in on this family. And they was like, oh my God, what is she going to do tonight? What are they going to do tonight? So, y'all, what the heck? It's going zone. Some type of natural ability that you have. And I feel like it has something to do with the mind. You know what it reminds me of? This guy's name is um, Yuri Geller. And he's on this network called Gaia. And so with this imagination, I embrace and nourish the creative aspects of my mind. He was on national TV. Telekinesis and photokinesis. He was on national TV, y'all. They had caught him on national TV. And he had what he can do is break spoons with his mind. But what happened was his spoon didn't just break tens of thousands of other people's spoons around the world also broke. That was some powerful shit right there. That was some powerful shit. So Maybe this Yuri Gale I'm picking up on. Because <laughs> he is on that network called Gaia. So, um, it costs $13.13 a month, child. Maybe some of y'all can manipulate light. Um, I don't know. It's kind of weird, but... I don't even want to talk about it. Because I think it's just coincidence. With the lights flickering and shit. But it happened all the time. So I'd be like, I just take it as my ancestors, 1444 on the phone. I just take it as the, like, okay, that's my ancestors telling me yes or no or whatever. But some of y'all could have telekinesis, the ability to move objects, or maybe y'all can manipulate light or something like that. 
But there's some reason that somebody feel entitled to your energy. And it could be because there is some type of breakthrough coming. <laughs> but some of y'all, somebody feel entitled to your damn money. And then they done put a block on you. If you got YouTube, get a block on your YouTube channel. There's some type of change that's coming for the better. And then for some of you, your, your skill is coaching, speaking, lobbying, activism, or mentoring. But for others of you, you do have natural talents, gifts, and abilities. And so this will, this telekinesis and photokinesis will fall up under that. Okay? All right, so let's see. Spirit. Maybe you are the dog whisperer. <laughs> you know? I don't, I don't know who I'm picking up on. Somebody out there. I did a reading of for this King of Pentacles. He was so fucking powerful. And but they was overworking him like to death. They was doing too much. But he was very, very powerful. Um That was before I knew anything about a year ago. I didn't learn about him until a year after I made that reading. <clears throat> but see, in that King of Pentacles, there was like beings, like angelic beings around this person. And when they was in danger or when they would have any fear or something like that, those beings would show up. And this card does say, caught on film, angels show up when in danger. So y'all might just want to go watch that. Because this independent, that's a masculine art right there. It really could be a king of pentacles. You know. Because it say your financial freedom will come from you being able to stand alone. That king of pentacles, he had like a manager with this money manager right here. And they would promise him, okay, so you're going to have... Uh, the end of next month is going to just be your time. And then they be done booked him. And, and he didn't want to disappoint his fans. So he would always work. But they was working him to death. He needed a break. So anyway. What do we need to see? Now, in that reading, I had picked up the energy of off the movie Cars. Because they was working him so much, he just went into hiding. And so everybody was looking for him. And I think he ended up in that little small town or something. I don't know. But what else, spirit? Some of y'all are getting a happy outcome when it comes to your finances. You cleaned up. Thank you. Mm -hmm. It looks good. <laughs> I went to buy some people. Oh, I'll talk to you later. Okay. King of Swords. So, what is who is this King of Swords? Why did I just get the um, the insurance company, the general? Maybe this person is an insurance. I don't know, y'all. Normally, the King of Swords is an authority figure. It could just be an air sign, Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius. All right, you have the star card in your reverse. So, this is like somebody could be trying to defame someone. Could be the King of Swords could be trying to defame somebody. Mm hmm. You have the Page of Cups with the two of them. Why are they doing that, though? They could have withheld information from you, withheld money from you, something that you may have needed. They probably withheld it. That, look, King of Pentacles. I'm telling y'all, this is a King of Pentacles for somebody. Oh, this King of Pentacles could feel sad. Why do they feel sad? 
could somebody could have been testing on this person. This is like a science room they have. Ten of Cups, King of Cups, Eight of Swords, Five of Wands. There could be a lot of shit going on around this King of Pentacles. For some of you, you could be getting the brunt end of what this King of Pentacles is going through. Some of y'all may have even had to, some of y'all could know this King of Pentacles and maybe you had to defend yourself from this person. You know, it reminds me. This King of Pentacles could somehow, I don't know how, but they could somehow have ownership over someone. Because if you look on this guy card, that's a number, and that ain't no damn social security number. Somebody could feel like you they damn property. Because remember I said somebody feel like they feel entitled to you. This is weird. Consider investing and committing yourself to your own business. Your financial freedom will come from you being able to stand alone. Maybe this is someone who invested in you. Or. And so it's like, if you're not working for them, maybe they try to defame you. Start in the reverse. Oh, um, what was I? I don't know if I was watching something or it was a reading. I can't remember. They was like, well, if you're not going to work for me, you ain't going to work for nobody. If you're not going to be with me, you ain't going to be happy with nobody. Like, what the fuck is going on, y'all? This really could be somebody who tried to defame you. And they could really put a curse on you. This, this person did too damn much. They already the king of pentacles. What else, what else do they want? This is somebody who got everything. The king of pentacles literally has everything. Six of Wands, Two of Cups, Four of Swords, Eight of Pentacles, The Moon, The Temperance. Maybe you had partnered with this person, because I just saw the Two of Cups. Six of Cups, that's like a public partnership for somebody that's in the public eye. But there's a Five of Cups here. Unless they put you on oh, Could have put you on camera. Could have put you in the public eye. Oh, How is this possible? What else here? Because some was caught on film. So this person... Is this person a producer? Or what, what, like, what the fuck is going on? Nine of Pentacles in the reverse. It could have took everything from you with this Nine of Pentacles in the reverse. Because in the upright, this is independent energy. In the reverse, it's codependent energy. <coughs> so, with that, it says you broke the curse, but I'm getting this person could have put a curse on you to like defame you and make you codependent. Why? Like, y'all, I be trying to figure out why. I always be wanting to know why. Yup, unstable. It could be a lot of... This, so that's the nine of pentacles in the reverse. A lot of ups and downs with your finances. Um, so this person put blocks on your YouTube channel. It's like any way you can make money with Money Manager, any way you can make money, they don't block that. Possibly with spell work. I don't know, y'all. I always be trying to figure out why. There could be a king of cups here. The 
world card. So look, and okay, the world card landed on top of, they put blocks on your YouTube channel. So there could be a band around you, like neighborhood watch. You didn't I say there's something with your neighbors all up in your asshole? You could be. And this person with the six of pentacles and four of pentacles, that's them holding back from you. Six of pentacles, four of pentacles is the ten of pentacles. And they feel entitled to you. This is weird energy. It has something to do with someone's family. The ten of cups. Three of pentacles, that's them installing cameras. Because you got to look at this motivator. How are these people seeing you if I ain't no camera? Look, your wife could be on the big screen right there. And this king of pentacles could be getting paid out for the child. Yep, nine of cups. Five of swords. This person could be getting paid out for that. You could even be in what, what they call uh, isolated. This person could have isolated you. Just have everybody watching and talking with the eight of wands. Yep, eight of swords. Could be some type of isolation. Then you have an emperor here with a higher fence. And the nine of wands. With the ace of swords, queen of cups, and the strength. So, there's some things about you. These people know. This king of pentacles knows. This emperor knows. That king of cups knows. But they want to keep you in this eight of sword. They want to keep you stuck. For some of you, this could be a father. Yep, they could be betraying you. For some of y'all, divine counterpart worked against you. Empress, ten of swords. Possibly for a ten of pentacles. Child. Somebody could be dealing with a cancer with a cherry. Or it's like a police or something. For some reason, this person feel entitled to you. And they could have wanted you to feel in the... Yeah, somebody wanted the Empress in the damn Five of Pentacles. It's still... I still don't want <laughs> Okay. So, this person is trying to defame you. Put you in the... Put you in a codependent situation, not a pentacles in the reverse, and put a curse on you and steal from you seven of swords and lie on you. It's, just, it's a lot. It's a lot. It could be a king of wands. It could be a lot of men doing this to a person. Maybe these men work for this hierophant to where they have like keys to. What is this higher if it could be an organization or institution, it could be the military, it could be any damn thing. Let me pull some more of these cards, see what come out. But yeah, they feel like you should not say nothing while they doing whatever this is. Yeah, you inspire. Some of y'all need representation right now, child. You inspire skeptics and others. Because this is too much. Some of you are from the angelic realm. So some of you could be earth angels. Some of you have the gift of healing. The CIA, that could be what they hire for me. Somebody's doing some foul shit to you. I don't know why. Unless they just want to defame you starting the reverse. Try to make you look bad. Nine of Pentacles. In the reverse, extraterrestrial. Baby, hell no. <laughs> hell no. To the no, no, no. Hell to the no. All right, so you have precognition, the ability to see into the future. So, yeah, some of y'all do got some abilities, but they still don't give this person the right to. Or maybe this person has the abilities and they're doing this shit to you. Because every time I get on YouTube, there's this, um, I don't know if it's a little show on FM radio that it pops up and it says, I'm surrounded with people with superpowers and I have none. And they was bullying him 
beating up on him because all of them had superpowers except for him. Y'all probably heard the little show, but it said that his family had left him a, an ability book because this is a, about abilities. Precognition, photokinesis, telekinesis, super senses. Those are abilities, right? Even the gift of healing and uh, from the angelic realm. But he was the only one that didn't have these abilities. So uh, they was always picking with him. Like, just doing all kinds of shit. Talentless talent. Talentless talent. The star in reverse with the nine of pentacles in reverse. <coughs> So, for some of you, this person has all of these abilities, and they could, and they could have been fucking with you that way. Okay, that that could be how this is, but I still don't. And then they could have put you on camera so the others, other people could see them doing this shit to you. Now, let me get my CD. Yeah. Ooh, child. That's for some of y'all. That's what's going on. I'm about to drink. This person could have all these powers and they could put you on camera and while all this shit going on. Okay. But it's still on. It still don't explain. There's some here with surgeon. There's it still does not explain them feeling entitled to you though. <laughs> Maybe someone's trying to control your life. What he say? Whoever controls her abilities? Oh hell no! It's a show I was watching on TV. Maybe somebody's trying to control your life, child. Like, let you know who in charge or something. Okay, so violations. Uh, it was, I thought it was, I was finna say vibrations, but it says violation. And what's this? God is setting you apart from the rest, six of wands. There is someone. Some major, someone's a major. There is someone who wants to thank you. I doubt if it's any of these uh, masculine energies on this board, but there is someone who wants to thank you. Yeah, because see, this Emperor Hierophant Nine of Cups, they're controlling something. And then it's like, well, if you're not going to do how I want you to do, or if you're not going to work with me or be with me, then you won't do it with nobody. Some shit like that, y'all. Okay, so let's go over it again. Some of you have the gift of healing. Some of you are from the angelic realm. Some of you inspire skeptics and others. Some of you have, like, super senses. Some of you have 
precognition, photokinesis, telekinesis, uh, chosen part 144, and connect with that Gaia. You could be strongly connected with Mother Earth. Why is the block? What, what's the block for? It's to hold someone back. Look, four of pentacles, six of pentacles. <coughs> There's somebody who wants to hold you back. They don't want you to be independent. Nine of pentacles in the reverse. But some of you, they don't want you in the spotlight either. Star in the reverse. So, yeah, y'all could be good with somebody trying to defame you. And so after going through all this, you really might need to go into some cleansing waters to cleanse all this bullshit. Okay, baby. What else, spirit? Hey. Feel like cleansing the water. And so with this regeneration, you could have lost everything. Now the pinnacles in the reverse, star in the reverse. You could have lost everything. And so maybe there's about to be some type of regeneration. Spirit face right there, shining the light on you, healing you from whatever was going on. Giving you, there could have been a fire, y'all. Keep getting all this, look like lava, red lava, child. But it's like giving you the kiss of life. Because something came to an end, 46 breaking down to a 10. But this regeneration, something's coming back. So I don't know who this person is to y'all. For some of y'all, it's just a group of men or women. Take how it resonates. Because you could be a man that I'm talking to, and these could be women around you. But for some of you, it's someone who has power. <laughs> They got the power, child. They sit on this bench right here. They can watch you from home. Some of you is masons, cause I keep picking up these red hats. Tell y'all that dream I had. I it wasn't even. I wasn't even sleep. I just closed my eyes and I see a room full of high chairs with the high backs on, them, just like this emperor chair. And um. Spirit was telling me they were shriners, so I had to look it up. I'm like, what is this? And when I found out that it was Mason, I got scared, y'all. ran to the bathroom, I started crying, because I initially thought of the movie Invitation. I wouldn't marry nobody out here, baby, hell no. Don't marry into this. That ain't what you want. Mm-mm. That's a whole other world that you probably ain't even ready for. And some of y'all, this masculine is into that. This masculine got some powers, child. Look at that fireball in their hand. This person could be an Aquarius or a fire sign or some type of air sign. Mm-mm. Somebody saying, I made you. That was somebody saying. They made you, child. The fates. This is like Empress Energy. 17, break it down to an 8. To the C. Maybe somebody wanted to leave you in your emotions. I feel like some of y'all could have the situations that you was going through. It's a paper boat inside of all that water. You're supposed to bend and drown, but you see spirit right there looking over the situation. <laughs> so with this breathe, this is giving focus. 29 break down to an 11. Focus on your intuition. There's some more water. Maybe this person has the ability to manipulate water. Cause we got that cleansing waters up there too. If this for some of you, maybe maybe one of these people had the ability to heal. 
Because he did say you have the spiritual gift of healing. Maybe this person with his soulmates, maybe they was trying to heal you. I don't know. Not every, I don't think everybody on this. Look, this, I, this is how this person wants you to feel. Now, I'm telling you now. Or thing. Nine of Pentacles in the reverse. Star card in the reverse. They want you to feel out in the cold. What the cards say? Empathy. I'm open to seeing both sides of the situation. This person wants you to... And then some of y'all... So, this person... Like I said, any way you can make money, they blocked it with the Five of Swords. And so you may have been left out in the cold and lost everything. And so now there could be a regeneration. But maybe not. It, it, it's coming in a change. With this change, there's a better, there's a change for the better coming your way. Embrace it. Could that person block eight of swords? Nine of this reminds me of someone bidding. Like, there could have really been some fucked up shit going on right here. But yeah, these people feel entitled to your energy. And they feel like you should not say nothing while they doing whatever they're doing. Hmm. That's weird, y'all. Okay, what else? For some of you, this could have been a job. Because this woman, she's like putting in this transmission. Some of y'all could have had a job that would have been for a masculine or... Shit. So maybe they didn't want you to be a part of the team. Y'all know we picked up on that last summer. Because maybe this person has uh, outdated beliefs. And maybe they felt like women's supposed to cook and clean. And not. This remind me of the movie Hidden Figures when he was like, there was one position open in that engineer program, engineer training program. But the card is saying, consider careers as a mechanic in automotive, aerospace, or repair technician. Also, with the Nine of Pentacles in the reverse, remember that when I was telling y'all, this man, he, um, I watched the show, the show, The Simpsons. He didn't like Homer. Everybody else liked Homer. Everybody thought he was funny. But he thought Homer was lazy, right? And he was over a power board, electric board, something like that. They worked at a plant, an electric power plant or something. And um, he was just, he kept trying to set up scenes to make Homer look bad. For some of y'all, that's what this person's doing. They're trying to make you look bad. Lost. You could have. You could have a job loss. Job loss can make it difficult to keep control of your money. Mm -mm. There's something better. There's something better coming. Just be patient. What the card says divine timing is at hand and it will require you to have faith while you are shown the way now if you feel tired and out of balance the universe is forcing you to rest and recover for some of you money may be slow coming in or you're unsatisfied with finances because this empress is in the five of pentacles and the swords <coughs> and then didn't we get something with animals or yeah so this card says animals. This one says animals. Um, some of you may have a career. Okay, so some of you are being asked to follow your instincts at this time when making business decisions. Any career working with animals, rescue association, or the veterinarian field could be just right for you if you can do this animal thing, like communicate intuitively with animals. That would be a good job. There's also something here with the bank. And then it says, connect to your power animal to improve your finances. Because eight of swords, five of pentacles. But the empress is very creative. That could be why the card says, I embrace and nourish the creative aspects of my mind. So you may have lost everything. I may have, have been in this energy of feeling like stuck or stifled or whatever. But there's something that you can create to come up out of this situation. Right? Again, God is express your divine feminine energy, embracing its magical intuition and nurturing qualities. Okay, what's this? Yeah. Earth angel. Somebody could be this to an earth angel child. Yeah, 
have to look at it. People picking up on that. I said, people in the. I said, if you subscribe to the Earth Angel Energy, because let's let's look, hold on. You got this chosen energy here, one forty four. You also have. Cause I thought I saw it. When they say you were from, yeah, Earth Angel. And so, they do that to those energies, for whatever reason. And or, this person has those abilities and did it to you. Just for some of y'all. They have those abilities, and they did this to you. Now, you see the card that says, opportunity to forgive. The situation brings you the opportunity to heal and grow. So, you might have to. Forgive this person for what this world did. Because it could, it could be somebody in your family, child. For some of y'all, you don't even know these people. Some of you do. What a spirit. Archangel Michael is helping you, though. Powerful Archangel working very closely to protect and guide you through the situation. Because if this person has all them abilities, imagine what the fuck they could do to you, child. Especially if somebody has, like, telekinetic. They probably could be moving shit around you, make you feel like you haunted. Fucking with the ability to manipulate light, make all your shit go out. Abilities in the future, super senses, ability to see, smell, and hear at vast levels above humans. Okay. But I feel like because you went through all of this, you inspire skeptics and others. Uh, uh. Ascended masters, powerful, loving, wise spiritual teachers watching over and guiding you. And again, be willing to forgive. And then you have innocence here. The person could even like, uh, Accused you of something. Some, for some reason, this could be a past life issue. So this could be someone from your past life coming to fuck with you in this life. It's not unheard of. So, with this innocence, this person could have thought you did something or said something. And then they could have did all this shit. Star in the reverse, nine of pentacles in the reverse. And then now you got to forgive them. All right, we have sacral chakra. So you're highly sensitive to chemicals, additives, processed foods, and energies right now. Respect your sensitivities by avoiding harsh items, situations, and relationships. You know what this reminds me of? One day I was in the hotel, right? Now, mind you, I done lost everything. Okay, so me and my son in the hotel... And this black guy, he come out of nowhere, right? First, I was sitting at the table, and it got hard for me to breathe. And here come this dude out of nowhere. I told y'all, he stared at me. With the power of his mind, it was hard for me to breathe. That's what that shit reminded me of. I couldn't breathe, I was like... <laughs> So, that's probably why Spirit is helping you get through this. Um, what do you desire? You now have the opportunity to write the script for your heart's so eyes. It has something to do with a child. I just saw the child card. But they say you um, care deeply about children. Some of y'all might want to reconnect with your inner child. Because this could have like, sucked the life up out of you, this situation. Now, if you're the one with these abilities, somebody could have tried to suck the life up out of you, right? But for others of you, if this person has the abilities, it could have just sent all these people on you and it, again, could have sucked the life up out of you. <coughs> I could think of so much more shit this person could do with them abilities. Right. If you have 
have the ability. Look, now it probably don't work like that, but that's just me being silly. If you can move objects, bro, move some bread over there to them homeless people on the corner. Would they be stealing? They probably would be stealing. If you took the bread out the grocery store with your mind and gave it to the homeless man. Yeah, that would probably be stealing. <coughs> but still, y'all, I'm, I'm mostly kidding, but come on now. Or oh, think about, like, photokinesis. Your kids don't want to go to bed at night. Use your mind, cut the damn lights off. Use your mind, cut the lights off. They can't cut it back on type shit. You know what I'm saying? Or your ass is tired. You, listen, you ready to go home. Y'all still got an hour's worth of work. Fuck with the lights. I'm just kidding, y'all. I'm just kidding. But I'm for real. <laughs> I'm for real, baby. Uh, oh, we having a, a, a problem with the lights. Well, I guess we'll have to close down early. Yeah, the kids. Oh, we watch TV. Mm, we having a problem with the the, the lights. The TVs won't work, Shh. baby. All right, I'm just kidding, y'all. Let's see what's going on right here. We're closing it out. Spirit. What's the message? Somebody pocket watching. Oh, that's what they would have. Okay, so ground yourself. When you come, when you detach from the awareness of your body and the physical world, you may become ungrounded. Although it is pleasant to float heavenward, your attention and work are needed here on earth. We are helping you to balance the spiritual and the material so that you can enjoy a fulfill, fulfilling earthly life. So maybe somebody got to get grounded. Okay. Emotional sensitivity and ear chakras. Notice the messages that appear as sound, music, and words from both external sources and within your mind. These messages are real answers to your prayers and emotional sensitivity, honor and respect your sensitivity, your deep sensitivities, as it is a gift to us all. So yeah, I don't know who got, but some of y'all think this person got all this power and I feel like they was fucking with you. In all these different kind of ways. But anyway, that's what I have for y'all. I love y'all from the bottom of my feet. I would do some shit by it. I told y'all to go to bed. Cut that light out and go to bed. Click. The lights would be out. <laughs> All right. Till next time.